Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to Dr. Case Academy. My name is Engineer Rahman Rihan. Today we are starting a new course on building construction engineering. Let's start the first lecture of this course. The outline of this lecture is course introduction, introduction to building construction, then we will explain the types of building, then components of building. General course introduction. The title of this course is Building Construction Engineering. The code of this course is C120 and uh, the course duration is one semester. It is a two credit all subject and it is a theory subject and it is teach on uh, in second semester. The medium of instruction is English. N no prerequisite course is required for this and not applicable in equivalent courses. The aim of this course is to enable students to, to understand various, various aspects of construction applicable to different components of building. To develop the ability of students to carry out the building construction projects according to drawing and specification. Course le learning outcomes. Upon su successful completion of this course, students will be able to describe the various parts of building, their construction, and associated parameters. Apply the knowledge of construction engineering to the building construction project. Teaching and learning activities. Course Learning outcome will be achieved through a combination of the following teaching strategies phases, homework assignments, class projects, midterm examination, final comprehensive examination. The content of this course is in the past week, we will study introduction to construction engineering and components of a building, and second week, site selection, orientation, and ventilation of building, and third week. Excavation and related expects and site investigation. In fourth week, construction of shallow foundation. In fifth week, construction of deep foundation. And sixth week, brick masonry construction. And seventh, block and stone masonry construction. Then you will have midterm examination in the eighth week. In nine week, palm work for various building units and overview of temporary structures. In ten week, surface rendering. In eleven, dampness control and buildings. And twelve. Construction of floors and 13, construction of roof and 14, joinery work and 15, construction of joints, plane protection and 16, develop of, development of construction project and maintenance, repair and retrofitting of buildings and 17, you will have final term exam. Books and references Civil Engineering Drawing, Third Edition by M. Chakarburti. Civil Engineering Drawing. Second edition by Gosharam Singh. Master in AutoCAD 2000, first edition, George Armura. Embark on B reinforcement concrete detail manual. Let's move towards building construction. The art of constructing buildings for residential, business, and other purposes, systematically according to your planning and design, as known as building construction. You can see in the figure that various techniques and uh, planning or use for constructing a building. So the concept of building houses or building is not new for mankind, but it is related to them from the very early age. So with the advancement and science and technology, only the methods and techniques have been changed in the hand of civil engineering. So let's uh, descri let's uh, describe buildings. Any structure constructed or engineered of whatsoever material and used for residential, business, and other purposes is called building. So, let's describe types of building. Buildings are classified into different categories on the basis of occupancy, construction, power resistance. So, first we have to classify on the basis of occupancy. So, by occupancy means that for what purpose the structure or the building is going to be used. So, on the basis of occupancy, building are classified are classified into different types such as assembly buildings, business buildings, educational buildings, institutional buildings, mercantile buildings, residential buildings. So let's discuss uh, these types in detail. Uh, first is assembly building. So uh, the building where a group of people gather for uh, enjoyment, recreation or social, religious and other similar purposes are called assembly building. So you can see in the mm, figure the chapel mosque, and this the people are gathered for uh, their religious purpose. So this is the example of uh, assembly building. And other example are uh, cinema, restaurants, 
wedding hall, etc. Business building. Building which are used for uh, keeping up records of accounts and other business transactions are called business building. Or we can say uh, business building or that building which are used for the purpose of business. So the example of uh, business building are uh, barber shop and uh, beauty parlor. You can see in the figure barber shop uh, where uh, we cut our hair and beer, etc. Educational buildings. So educational buildings are that buildings uh, which are used for the purpose of education. Example of this schools, college, and libraries. Institutional buildings, buildings which are used for the purpose of medical or other treatment purpose is called institutional buildings. Uh, example of uh, institutional buildings are nursing homes, health care centers, and other hospitals. You can see in the figure. Hyderabad Medical Complex Peshawar. Mercantile buildings are dead buildings which are used for the display and sales of goods. Example of uh, mercantile buildings are shops, stores, market. Residential buildings are dead buildings which are used for purpose of residency. It's called as residential building. Example of this is apartments, flats, hotels, etc. You can see in the uh, figure uh, Islamabad Serena Hotel. So this is a uh, example of residential building. Uh, second types classification on the base of construction. On the base of construction, buildings are classified into the following different types. Number first, brick and block masonry buildings. Number second, stone masonry building. Number third, RC frame building. Number fourth, wooden buildings. Number five, Adobe building. The building which are made from brick are known as brick masonry building, and the building which are made from uh, block is known as block masonry building. And the building which are made from uh, stone is known as stone masonry building. And the building which are made from reinforcement concrete and uh, made from frame, so it is known as RC frame building. And the building which are made from wood is known as wooden building. And the building which are made from adobe is known as adobe building. Classification on the base of fire resistance. Here we have four types of buildings on the base of their resistance against the fire. Type 1, type 2, type 3, type 4. Type 1 having the ability to withstand with fire for minimum 4 hours. And type 2 have a minimum 3 hours resistance to power and type 3 having the ability to withstand with power for minimum 2 hours and type 4 having the ability to withstand with power for minimum 1 hour. Let's move towards the last topic of, uh, of our uh, lecture which is components of buildings. So basically we have uh, two components of building uh, which is uh, substructure and superstructure. So uh, uh, in the figure, you can see that the substructure are the structure which are below the ground level, which include the basement and the foundation. And basement is used for the residential purposes, and foundation are used to absorb the entire load of the building. And the superstructures, so the structure which are above the ground level is known as superstructure. And this consists of floors, roof, doors, windows, walls, etc. Components of buildings in detail is foundation, vertical supporting elements such as wall, columns, floors, roof joinery, uh, in which doors, windows, ventilators are included, hall ceilings, surface rendering, staircase, lift, escalator, parapet wall, electrification system, sanitary and plumbing system. All are all these. Are the components of a building so you can see in the figure are uh, different components of a buildings such as foundation roof walls doors windows these this is pillar and this is a building finishes and and the plant level we provide the pin beam thank you for hearing me if you have any question, you can comment.